free throw, Cadi. Cadi, did you know I have a YouTube channel? And you're gonna be on it. Mm -hmm. You excited? Yes, I have a YouTube channel that I've started since I was a player here, mm -hmm. and it's like a vlog. Like we bring it on the road when we travel. Everything. It's fun. Yes. First official day, Grace LaVarge. What do you have to say right now? First official day of practice. Very, very excited. I feel like we've been going for a little bit, but this is the first official day. Let's go. Yeah. Who put this playlist on, Jackie? Was this you? No. no. Whose vibes are these Rose right now? Rose Castle? Wow. Rose Castle, this is you on the Ox? Yeah, wait till, wait till it's hard. Sierra, first official day of practice. What do you have to say? Anything inspirational? One day at a time. Do not stress yourself out. This is where we get better. We've got a big, big gear day ahead of us. Feels like we're doing this stuff every day, but kind of the summer into the fall always feels like this because it's just never ending because more and more and more boxes just keep coming in. So all our sweatsuits came in. We had a little bit of a technical difficulty with some color shades matching, but uh, you know, we it is what it is. You go through the obstacles and uh, <laughs> you're over the obstacles and you, you overcome. So pushing through adversity here in terms of uh, some color schemes, but uh, yeah, all good. Handing out some stuff. Players just got their ultra boost, which we wear on the road. So, this is their travel shoe, so we'll travel in these, and they'll get their trainers for Coach B, strength and conditioning, and then obviously basketball sneakers and stuff too. So, pretty good, but uh, it's kind of we're going through a lot of boxes today, so a lot of busy work, nothing too too exciting. That's the update. Hey guys, it's CT here, and I'm going to be asking my team some questions. Michaela, hello. Who would you not let your son or daughter date? Um, I'm going to have to go with Kenza Rose. Okay. Jill, who would you not let your son or daughter date? Mackenzie Helms. Ooh, Helms. Who would you not let your son or daughter date? Mackenzie Helms. That's two or three? Three. 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 This is Cadi, our freshman. Cadi, who would you not let your son or daughter date on the team? I gotta go with Z. Z? Yeah. <laughs> That's four. <laughs> this is our uh, junior here, Tiara. Who would you not let your son or daughter date on the team? Rose Carolee. Ooh, Cavs. That's two. It's our another freshman guy. <laughs> Ella, isn't she so pretty? Who would you not let your son or daughter date on the team? Um, probably Rose Carolee. Ooh, that's three. It's, it, she catching up. Who would you not let your son or daughter date on the team? Rose Carolee. Ooh, it's Todd. Oh, get, get that, get that. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, this is Mary Baskerville. Our transfer from Providence. Who would you not let your son or daughter date on the team? Rose Castro. Okay. Jackie Grisdale. Who would you not let your son or daughter date on the team? I don't know. Yeah, this is a lot of pressure. I'm already sweating. <laughs> Michaela Morris. Oh. Ooh, okay. <laughs> Here with Grace. Who would you not let your son or daughter date on the team? Rose Cabrera. Perfect, yes. Guys, here with Rose Cab. Who would you not let your son or daughter date on the team? Mm, Mackenzie Helms. <laughs> it's Todd! It's Todd still. You need to break it. You need me to break it. Guys, we're here with Jazz. The best dobo in the world. Who would you not let your son or daughter date on the team? 
I'm gonna pass. <laughs> Guys, we're here in the training room. AT, give them a little. We're here with Becky and Mac. Mac, who would you not let your son or daughter date on the team? There's a tie. <laughs> Just to let you know. Mackenzie Helms. Ooh, that's it. Friday morning, October 7th. Just getting a little workout right now in the rec center on main campus. Today is a big day because we are prepping for our first actual opponent other than ourselves. We have a scrimmage tomorrow morning. Um, so we're excited about that, but we've got film and scout today. So it really feels like we're kind of getting into things now that we're prepping again for not playing against ourselves. We're actually going to see another opponent and really give us a test and see uh, kind of where we are at this point in the season. So super excited about that, but getting a quick little sweat in first. Um, but we'll take you through the day. So again, film and scout practice, the girls also have lift. So it'll be a, a long day, but we're trying to make it as concise as possible in terms of getting them in and out in the morning because we do play tomorrow. So that's the update. But but uh, yeah, big time, ready to go. Jumping into the vlog quick with a little voiceover of a practice segment. Here's a nice little passing drill that Coach Sully, um, our new coach on staff, brought over to us and has introduced us to. So it starts on a post feed like you saw. We're going to face up. We're going to skip past it out. Then we're going to hit the elbow that's flashing for a little high post entry. And then it's going to finish with a backdoor cut and a skip pass to restart. So there's no shooting in the drill. It's all passing communication talk. You could see the first time we did it, we uh, definitely jacked some stuff up, but just being totally transparent on it with you guys this is one of the first times so it will take a little bit for the players to get used to but it's a nice little warm-up drill works every type of pass you pretty much have in the game um, obviously starting with that post entry which we know can be tough for uh, players to feed the post so post entry then it gets to the skip pass then you get the flash to the elbow so we want to hit the outside hand on that bounce pass um, then that back door pass um, cutting from the wing into the baseline drift pass and then it resets so hope you guys enjoyed that little segment. What up guys? It is Thursday afternoon. I'm actually driving right now to Luhai for an open gym. So New York is one of my recruiting states. So over the course of the fall, um, really just September, October, we try to get to as many open gyms as we can. Didn't have practice today. We had an off day, but got a couple uh Shots up with a couple kids. I wanted to get some extra work in, so did that. We rewatched practice as a staff earlier, and then I hit the road at like 1.30. So again, just on the way now, and then it'll be a kind of a late night, but um, back to practice tomorrow, scrimmage Saturday. But um, yeah, open gyms, just another part of the recruiting aspect of things um, in terms of AAU finishing up in the summer when you go out on the road um, to more of the far states and tournaments over the course of July. Uh, these open gyms are kind of just one night things usually, a um, couple hours where the kids get to be with their high school teams um, and they get to do some drills, scrimmaging and stuff, but it's good because you get to see them in a different setting. So I guess that's the value in open gyms is a kid that plays AAU, um, you know, might not get as many touches on their AAU team because their AAU team might be super talented. Whereas a kid that is on their high school team might be the star of their high school team or just might have a bigger role. Oysters, obviously. Yeah, so I'm gonna put to the tartar. 